What's going on guys? Mike Go back and I'm going to break a blaster box of 2017 Topps Gypsy Queen. This is a product I always enjoy. Like doing hobby boxes, like getting some of the autographs. The autographs in this product always look really sharp, really good design, really clean looking autographs. But for right now, we're just going to go with a blaster. I'm sure at some point I'll break into some hobby, and I'll definitely be buying some singles of this this year, as well as Topps Tribute. Both just came out. Baseball season is about to begin. Looking forward to it. So let's uh, take a little preview of what Gypsy Queen is all about this year. This blaster box includes eight packs, six cards per pack, so 48 cards, and there is at least one short printed base card guaranteed. Um, I didn't look to see. I'm sure it's a higher number. But, hey, let's just uh, see what we get here, and I'll figure out the rest a little later. So, these blasters are $19.99, regular price. I had a uh, coupon I could use, so got this for like $18. Um, so, not bad. This is what the packs look like. As you can expect, Cubs heavy. Got Chris Bryant and Schwerber. So I think you're going to see a lot of Cubs stuff this year for obvious reasons. They're possibly, if not the best team in baseball, plus they're coming off the World Series victory. So here's what we have right here. Kevin Kiermeyer is our first card. This is what they look like. Gypsy Queen always has a nice uh, look to them. Great binder material, great uh, cards for player PCs and team collecting, or set collecting if you're into that as well. Brad Ziegler is a nice... Uh, Marlins card for him. Corey Dickerson. Zach Britton. I do. I'm really liking these cards. Ryan Braun. And Elvis Andrus. So I definitely am digging the design on 2017 Gypsy Queen. Really uh, enjoy the old looking style cards. But I look forward to all these products, man. Every product has like their own. You know, you have base tops, which has that nostalgic tops feel every year you have heritage and uh gypsy queen so ian desmond jimmy nelson here's a fortune teller it's a uh, little mini here dansby swanson so that's interesting Let's see what those are i don't know if you guys can read that but uh There's a lot of stuff to look up there. Well, I'll figure it out. Here's a really nice Chris Bryant. Beautiful looking card. Bartolo Cologne in the uh, in the Braves Uni. Anyway, Topps Tribute just came out as well. That's a beautiful product this year. A little pricey, though. Um, I've never busted Tribute. I usually just buy singles. Here's Rizzo. Cabrera. Nomar Mazzara. Rick Porcello, Wilson Ramos, and Jose Abreu. So I will definitely, uh, at some point, pick up a hobby box of this. And You know, I like the base cards in this. I like putting together a little collection of them. I don't really build sets usually. I just kind of pick out players or different cards that I like the way they look, and I'll just load them up in a binder. Irvin Santana, Bautista. Nice Gary Sanchez, second year card. Be interesting to see how he performs this year. Steven Strasburg. Only a couple packs left. Man, that's the problem with these blasters, man. They go so quick. So quick. Grandal. John Lester. Steven Metz. It's an Elvis Andrus parallel. I know we I saw uh so one of these, uh, an Andrus before. Josh Bell, rookie. Jordan Zimmerman. Three packs remain. I should probably get in the habit of checking out the, uh, the short prints and stuff first. But, Edwin Diaz. Beautiful Mike Trout. Trey Turner. Jared Weaver, Lou Gehrig, uh, Colin Ray, 
All right, second to last pack. We've got Eric Hosmer from Team USA, Adam Lynn, Alex Gordon, Kyle Seeger, Aaron Judge Rookie, Carlos Gonzalez. So one final pack. So I'm sure one of these is a short print. I got to uh, do some research after I'm done here and uh, figure out which one it was. CJ Cron, Lance McCullers, and Dralton Simmons. Hand-drawn art. That's pretty nice. Looks like Robinson Cano. Congratulations, you've received a portrait art reproduction issued by 2017 Topps Gypsy Queen. Four and three. I'm not sure uh, how tough they are to pull, but they're pretty nice looking. Gregory Polanco and Jose De Leon. So, guys, I definitely enjoy this product. I like the look of the cards. I would certainly recommend picking up a blaster or two, and if you're really into it, it's definitely worth a hobby purchase. Guys, comment below. Let me know what you think of Gypsy Queen. Get excited for baseball. Hit the like button, subscribe, and I will talk to you guys next time. Have a great one.